Why don't we go on a long expedition today? To help out the settlers at Somerville Palace? Yeah. Okay. Um! Um, um! Excuse me! We're fast traveling here! Do you mind? Very inconsiderate of you! That's a good start to our journey. That thing's oh, that tough, huh? Nice. It definitely... Oh. oh, she does like a little celebration! <laughs> Alright! That's fun. <laughs> Issues here, Zach. Issues. Someone followed us. Ah! <laughs> we haven't checked out this dam yet, have we? Could I don't be, think so. Could be some stuff. Whoa! <laughs> nice work. Oh. Um. Okay, all the squids are dead. All my squids are dead. All my squids are dead. Oh, this isn't a dam. It's a lock. High lock. Up goes the ship. Low lock, the ship takes a dip. You can take a cargo ship from sea to shining sea, cross the Panama Canal for a nominal fee. I've never heard that before. What is that from? The Animaniacs. Oh, God, I should have known it was Animaniacs. <laughs> How is it that show is so goofy and yet sometimes it's educational? Oh, this is just the operations center for the lock. Doesn't really seem to be a whole lot in here. Hmm. Whoa, I found a secret door. What's down here in the reactor level? Um, absolutely not. Oh! The, the reactor is down here. Oh, that makes sense. Yeah. Can I turn the reactor on? Why would you want to? No. Well, I mean, I think it's already on, but ooh. Well, that was a great time. Ooh. Thank you. This place is dead anyway. Yeah. <laughs> Just like the squids, eh? Hey. Ah! Whoa! Hello. Um, excuse me. I need doctors to... around these days. Should let me take a look at you. Uh, you're a doctor. Yeah, sure. See what's wrong with me. Now go over your symptoms for me, one at a time. He's got a runny nose, and also he smells bad, and he's got bad breath, eye boogers. Sometimes wax comes out of my ears. All right. Let's flush your system. Ugh. Everything! Flush that earwax out, Doctor! Ooh, can you give me an enema while you're at it? Ugh. Take better care of yourself in the future, okay? No, make me. Ooh, did I tell you that I got a uh, $700 pistol for 100 bucks? No, that's quite the deal. Yeah, I got a like a $700 pistol for $120. How did you swing that? Um, it was a gun that was damaged in a break-in. Basically, the gun got a bunch of broken glass on it, which... Put some minor scrapes into the gun. So, um, so the gun was lightly scratched up? and it The gun, yeah. It's a polymer frame gun and it was lightly scratched. So insurance had basically paid for the entire thing. So I just had to pay for what the insurance didn't pay for. Oh, all right. So yeah. $700 gun for 120 bucks. You made out like a bandit, my friend. Yup. I legitimately spent more money on groceries than I did on this gun. Normally, I criticize you for wasting money buying firearms, but that actually seems like a pretty good investment. Yeah, it honestly was... What the fuck is going... We need to get out of here because the map is horribly broken. Don't forget to grab the mutated fern for Heather, though. Oh, is that what Heather wants? Yes. Okay. Um, yeah, I was like, if I... What the... F Am I stuck in here? Oh, no. <laughs> Help, Mike. Stuck in. Just climb. Yeah, I can't climb. Climb harder. I'm trying. It's too slippery. Use the windowsill as a foothold. I. It will. <laughs> oh, for fuck's sake. <laughs> oh no, this man's being killed. Oh, he's dead. So oh no, he's not. Let's save him. Don't worry, Mister. We'll save you. Whoever he is in this glitchy building that keeps on disappearing for some reason. Hey! Oh, so you oh for God's sake, dude! All right. Can you stop hanging out around ghouls? They ain't gonna be your friends. Stop hanging around around broken cool. villages. So you're not a shambler. Good thing I didn't shoot ya. Um, would have been uh, I don't know, ah. awkward. <laughs> yeah, that would have been awkward. You look familiar. Are you my spotter? You're what? Yeah, hello, Mr. Ghoul. <laughs> Do you think you're a sniper or something? You're gonna die. 
<laughs> Everything That's about this is messed up. Oh. God, this is such a fucking hot mess. What are you doing, man? <laughs> Every no, time. stop! On, stop! Stop attacking things and just fucking talk to me, my guy. Oh my god. It's like they uh get addled. Hey! What are you doing? What am I doing here? I think I was trying to throw away ammo. That was a great fight. Would explain all the shells. <laughs> yeah. This no non-stop. Oh my god. I, I'm not even gonna try. We can't anymore. even have a conversation because there's a billion fucking ghouls. Gunners now? We, okay. Are we, we good now? Okay, are we finally done? Oh, you have a hover chest full of loot, do you? You look familiar. Are you my spotter? Are you by yourself out here? No, you're here too. <laughs> Why are you wearing that mask, buddy? You didn't know. Yeah. Hate to break it to you, but there was this whole war. Things got blown up, left a lot of bad things in the air. Dust, dirt, something called asbestos. Why do I wear a mask? First rule. You gotta keep a safe and secure workplace. It's actually pretty smart, considering he's exploring destroyed urban buildings. Okay, where are you going? I, uh, well, I don't remember. I know for sure I was going left. But then it got turned around, and left wasn't left anymore. It was right. Maybe I'll go back. But is back forward now? Or forward, back? Want to travel with us? All right, I'll follow. But it's probably good to keep a healthy distance. I don't like sharing air. It's like drinking from the same glass. Or kissing. Which is weird, you know, because we just met. <laughs> yes. <laughs> You're freaking weird, dude. Probably not a good idea to let a supervillain like the Mechanist live. It usually only takes a few issues for them to start being evil again. <laughs> Okay, you, you pushed me safe. Good idea. That was very noble of you. That sick. was incredibly noble of me. Yes, I am running away from this place because it's broken. All right. Hopefully now everyone is up. Oh, good. We still got a guy following us. <laughs> I'm gonna reach your limbs off. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Darlene just disappeared. Oh, we got room for this guy now because we have one fewer follower. <laughs> Hello, random stranger. Sitting out here on side road. What up? Please. Do you have any ran away? I think I may be dying. Yeah, sure. Here you go. Oh, thank you. You just saved my life. Donations are good for karma. Mm -hmm. We might have needed that. Don't just oh, look at there. You know what else we need? The kill is fair, darling. Try. Whoa! <laughs> <laughs> Yikes! Bear has been dealt with. <laughs> I'm just gonna stay here a bit to regain my strength. Careful, there's flying bears. <laughs> bear was just like, <laughs> some bear over the, the rainbow. rainbow! <laughs> <laughs> These gunners sure picked the wrong egg to steal. It's a lot safer stealing bug eggs. They got so many children, they don't really care if you adopt some. Stop talking about a question you weren't around for. I hear more Meyer Lords. Don't worry, we'll take care of them. No, I want to help. What do you and want your depth charges for? Because depth charges are fun. Submarine detected! Fire depth charges! Assigned baseball. Oh, oh so valuable. Wow, <laughs> it's actually a thing, huh? Yeah. Picking locks works you. way better than shooting them. Yes, it does. Broadcast station, okay. You are listening to WRVR. George, Rex is in trouble. Didn't you hear him on the radio? For the tenth time, yes. What do you want me to do about it? Those super mutants would kill me in seconds. Rex got himself into this mess. He'll have to figure out how to get out of it. George Cooper. Hello. I'm glad to meet you. I'm Anne Hargreaves. George and Rex and I run this radio station. Well, hello there, Anne. Rex sounds like he's gotten himself into trouble. Again. Yeah, it sounds like he's in quite the pickle. Is that some kind of pun about super mutants being green? 
I appreciate the attempt at levity, but my mood is quite dour, what with Rex being in the hands of those brutes. We've Dour? done some wonderful radio plays. Looks like you a good place to take a rest. Oh, goodness, there's another woman in here, too. Hello, Vicky. Is that a pit boy? <gasps> oh, my God! It's you! The one from all the rumors. The what? hero frozen in time. I, I hate to sound like a groupie, but... Do you think there might be room for me on one of your settlements? Go to uh, Red Rocket, I guess? Oh my god, yes! I'll be there right away! Cool, you can be my new girlfriend. Rex sounds like he's gotten himself into trouble. Again. What do you want us to do about it? Mount a rescue, of course! Gather together what men you can and storm their lair. I should think 30 or 40 should do. Nah, don't want to. Hello. I'm worried about Rex. Those super mutants are so brutal. I don't know, he'll probably be dead soon. That's a cold thing to say. Rex is my friend and mentor. I'm not going to wash my hands of him just like that. Well, I suppose you want me to go help him then. Oh, I thank you for offering. I'm ever so grateful. What do you do here? I used to make the costumes for our plays. Back when we still put on live shows. But that became on the dangerous. On the radio? So now I'm just one of the actors in Rex's radio plays. Why would you make costumes for a radio program? No, they used to put on live plays. She for, said... For she, the radio! No, she said they used to do live plays. On the radio! You no, can, not on the radio! They used to do live performances. You can make live performances on the radio! Oh my god, Mike. They used to do live performances in front of people... But it became too dangerous, so now they do a radio show. Oh, okay. How would you like to work for me as a seamstress? That does sound interesting. Okay, I'll do it. I think I'll enjoy making clothing again. I'm sure you will, and you'll never have to worry about Rex again. <laughs> just completely ignored him all- Hey, George. Uh, you're on your own now, buddy. <laughs> I just stole your girlfriend. <laughs> Here comes Mr. Steel Your Girl. Stole, anyway. Stole both of them, honestly. I know. I just came in here and ruined this guy's whole life. He was like, Rex is finally gone, and I have a harem. I'm, I hope it's worth it. Sorry, sorry. Oh, not ah! No, it was just a glow. No, our seamstress. Oh, no, she's fine. Oh, I can see underwear. <laughs> I see Paris. I see France. I can see your underpants. Stop it! Stop it! No! No! That's not right! If I could just get my hands on a table, I think I can make some chairs out of what? cinder blocks pretty easily. What the fuck is happening over here? Oh, yeah, it's a robot fighting... a deer. You just got donkey kicked by a deer. Ah, deer beat well. What a lovely day. Oh, to come oh, he's going for it. He's going for it. He's got. Oh, what do we got? What do we got? Ah, uh, placing bets. Placing bets. All bets. All bets down. All bets down. Come on, get him, deer. Get and this. the deer is moving. The deer is moving to. The deer has done a high flying front footed kick. And what do we have? Another high flying front footed kick to the face of the robot. And he charges him down. <laughs> the deer won. The deer went. <laughs> Two high-tech security robots versus a deer. Deer won. The deer wins and thus protects the rest of his herd for days to come. Who would put money on the deer? I, nobody. That's why anyone that put money on deer fucking made out like a bandit in that last one. Hello, sir. Ah, a new customer. Welcome customer. to Max Bar. We are currently open for business. Please <laughs> excuse the mess. This is a nice location. Thank you kindly. Pick the place myself. Plenty of room for expansion in an up-and-coming neighborhood at an unbeatable price. I, he started a bar here. I... Oh man, just, you just wait till the rainy season and that river floods. There, you guys don't have to queue for the bar, but okay. <laughs> you lose. Oh boy, oh boy. Stop him, stop him. I want to slow him down a little bit. God damn it. I'm no, dead. Don't worry. Someone will come help you out. Thanks, new guy. Come on. All right. Human time is done! This is the age of the- <laughs> <laughs> Was it really the age of- So does maritime law apply to places like this? I just want to make sure before I start shooting. Just crap in here. 
Just crap in here, she says. Filled with shotguns and buff out. Oh, that's a whole lot of steroids. And 10 mil ammo and 12 gauge ammo and... Oh, uh, so much crap. Whoa! Kid, I don't know who you are, but you better clear out before I go haywire and blast you. Settle the fuck down. Yeah, we just want to talk. Right. You just strolled in out of the Commonwealth looking for synths to talk to. You're a synth? I've never seen you at any of the meetings. You think this is a joke? They take people out of their beds and replace them with... with things like me. Machines. Any second now, they might send some signal. Or I'll see the color orange. Or whatever it is they do and... Boom! One more dead fool. Now, are you gonna get out of here? Or wait for them to make me kill you? We're just talking. You can put the gun down. Fine. But don't think this means you're welcome here. Okay. Got your looky-loo at the synth. Is there a weapon Fine. workbench up here? Just do whatever you came hey, in. Hey, the there hell. is. Ooh, and stay nice. out of my stuff. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. What do they think 308 ammo is? Because apparently the high caliber, it says larger 5 millimeter rounds. Do you know what 308 is in millimeters? Almost 8 millimeters. Is 8 millimeters bigger than 5 millimeters? Gee, I don't know, Mike. You can do math. What do you think? Hmm, I can't do gun math. You guys have weird rules. No, it's... It, it, yeah. 8 millimeters is bigger than 5 millimeters. Sorry, Phyllis. We're leaving. You can shoot Birdie on his way out if you want to. Is there anything else, chest? <laughs> Le leather lane mine! <laughs> <laughs> Maybe she booby trapped the marina. I, you know, I'm willing to bet she did. How do people get in here? Oh, there's a door. Thank you for showing thank him, you, Darlene. Thank you, Darlene. Thank you. Um, remind me to stop making fun of you. <laughs> All right, well, let's move on. Oh my god. <laughs> water. A fish's best friend. Why is water a fish's best friend? <laughs> it's not their enemy. It's, no, they need water to breathe. Air is my best friend. There they are. Looks like crab cake for dinner. Who is hungry? Ah! Wow, these things are fucking hard to kill. Oh, great, I'm... That is so infuriating. <laughs> it breaks your army and equips your weapon? Yeah, <laughs> that is absolutely infuriating. Stop letting your arm get broken, then. All right. <laughs> I feel like the shotgun is a lot better now that I have it not use explosive shells because it's not overpowered! You're not supposed to back over it. Come on, show me what you've got. Show me what you got! <laughs> well, not alone. No. Oh, is that a... That's a dolphin. I'm glad we have the additional firepower from Birdie here. I'm the one that shot them with a the shotgun. He provided covering fire. He, uh, what, yeah, he provided suppressing fire with his bolt action hunting <laughs> rifle. <laughs> hey, we found a Western guard. All right. Whoa, it, it's worth up to a hundred dollars. And that guy's holding the gun while that guy's holding the gun and shooting at him. Pew, pew. Ooh, uh, <laughs> uh, Gary? Dead guy from Vault 108, huh? Yeah. The rigor mortis always gets me. Gee, I wonder what could it possibly say. Gary, 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 oh, Gary, 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 <laughs> Gary. I think we need to give Gary the Viking burial he deserves. Um. Okay. Ashes uh, to ashes, Gary to Gary. We bury this Gary in the earth, Gary. Gary end. Good night, sweet prince. And flocks of heavenly Gary sing to thy Gary. <laughs> you know what his favorite firearm was? Gary. A Garand. Ah! <laughs> <Ooh>. <laughs> <laughs> that is not as teenified as we were going for. That's not de Okay, let's go, let's go. God damn it. You're gonna What the hell are you doing? <laughs> what the hell is this place? Hey, fuck this, I'm out. No, no, no! You come back and explain your art, sir! <laughs> that was a noob grenade. <laughs> I 
keep forgetting I have those equipped. <laughs> I would have tried to hatch the death claw and raise it as a pet. Dog meat's great, but he has his limits. One, you weren't there for that quest. Two, we haven't named him dog meat. I think I'm full. Nope. Wait. Got room for dessert. <laughs> there you go, Birdie. <laughs> there you go, Birdie. Now you remember a Vault 108. I'm not going to pretend to understand art. I only understand... You don't have to fix it up, darling. Darling, has this become your mission in life? <laughs> All right, the town we were, we're coming here to see. Yay, we're finally here. Hello, children. Hello. What you doing? Have you seen Diamond City? It's huge. Haven't been yet. Nope. Yeah, never been there. Working on a farm is really boring. Boring is better than being dead. We could really use your help. We're with the Minutemen. How can we assist? We're not <laughs> with the fucking Minutemen. Something nasty's living just around the corner from here. It's only a matter of time before there's some real trouble. Now, yeah, what's really too bad is it'd be a nice spot for a new settlement. Oh. In fact, I know some folks that'd love to set up there if it was safe. If you can make sure the old workshop there is still in one piece, anyone who decides to move in later will be able to rebuild. Yeah, okay, I'll take care of it. I hope so. We didn't know what to do. Birdie, now is not the time for checkers. We have we have important things to do. Uh, there's a thing right here. Oh, it's just a train yard. They lost some. Uh... Concrete okay, tubes. okay, 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 okay. What? There is no way in hell that a tree this small would stop that concrete pipe. Do you have any idea how much this thing would weigh? Well, those trees were probably a lot sturdier back then. I not to uh, well, all right. I feel like there should be super mutants here. Gore bags? Are yep, there are. Stop him! 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 Oh my god! Oh my god! Oh my god! That was scary. Are you pushing? Is it just me or was that too easy? Yes. Why were you using a hunting rifle without a stock on it, my guy? Oh, you hear that? Shit, 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 shit. What? Got him! <laughs> yes! Oh, shit, a second one! <laughs> oh, sorry, Valkyrie! Sorry, sorry, sorry. Oh, man, why do they- Oh my god, a third one! <laughs> why? Why do they need more than one? Ow, ow, ow. My legs didn't do bullets. I like toy stores. Oh, look, it's a giddy up buttercup. It's intact. How oh, cute. I get that everything's useful, but make sure to wear gloves. <laughs> Shut up. He's trying to be sanitary. Oh, look, Rock'em Sock'em Vault Boys. Nice. Ooh, a Liberty Prime toy. I can't take that, unfortunately. Man, there's a bunch of cool toys in here. Oh, look, they were playing Rock'em Sock'em Vault Boys. Yeah, they were. They were betting on it too, and getting drunk. South Sea Stories, Vengeance of Loana. Okay, so here's what's happening. Here's what's happening. She is an e-girl, and this guy's like, I paid her $6,000 and she didn't say my name on stream. <laughs> Birdie. Bur Birdie. Birdie, now is not the, you look he looked like the manager at a Wendy's. He was the safety inspector. Too <laughs> many corpses, F minus. Yeah. Yikes! <laughs> yeah. Oh boy, oh boy. Ow, 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 ow. Ah, help! Hey look, you brought- Oh, oh my god! god. <laughs> yeah, just, just bring them all to our position. Here you go, hold on to this please, thank you! Ow! <laughs> I like that kamikaze grenade. Oh boy! Look at all those, you cleared them all out. Hey, an alarm clock. <laughs> oh my god. Hey, don't worry, he's coming to rescue you. <laughs> so, this is the famous Jamaica plane. Dying for fun. It's pretty plain, all right. Not sure how Jamaica it is, though. <laughs> Did we mean, what? Okay. Yeah. Not sure how Jamaica it is. <laughs> Jamaican me want to shoot you in the face. <laughs> Do you know why that guy from Vault 108 had so many friends? Why? He was gregarious. Ah! <laughs>
You know why that one guy didn't like to swear? Why's that? He wasn't a fan of vulgarities. Uh. You know what that guy's favorite alcoholic drink is? Uh, something involving the word Gary. Margaritas! Uh. <laughs> you know why he didn't like wearing that outfit? Oh, Why's that? It was kind of garish. <laughs> Guess what his favorite sport was? Badminton. It was tennis, but close enough. <laughs> <laughs> Jesus Christ! I think you might need a wheelchair. <laughs> Mayor's Diary, day one. Look at all these damn ghouls. Treasures exhibit speech. Friends, neighbors, and honored guests, we're gathered here today to commemorate the treasures of Jamaica Plain. Though ours may be a small community, it is rich in history, rich in culture, rich in memory, and rich in corporate greed. And for the sake of those memories, we commit these treasures to the earth that future generations might look back and remember where we stood and see how far they come. Okay, let's go steal that treasure. Budget statement. Property taxes, that's a lot of money. This neighborhood used to be full of artists and hipsters. I bet they turned to ghouls before it was cool. <laughs> oh my god. Oh, hello. Sal. Damn it. Worthless bastards. Scattered like rad roaches the moment they saw their first school. I've spent months prepping for this off. There's no way I'm backing out now. Yeah. That treasure will be mine. What treasure? Even if I have to dig it up with my own bare hands. What treasure? A few more duels. Wow, I, I'm just, I'm just going to miss every single shot. Mm -hmm. I get mad at myself when I miss repeatedly. I, you know, when I do that, I don't blame myself. I blame my dumb hands. How dare they? How dare you, stupid hands? I... Ah, come <laughs> on. Keep being games. I'm sure yourself. And then that Darlene becomes right invisible. Off. Is that gum? Fuck no, that. you're gone, Darlene! <laughs> Welcome back. <laughs> Congratulations, Mike. We cleared the way for the settlers to come here. Hooray! They, they should be so happy. And now that we've done so much to help them, let's go get that treasure before they fucking get here. Yeah! It's ours now. In the basement of this building. Yeah. Yeah. Someone's gonna get shot today. Not me. Not me. Someone's gonna get shot today. It'll probably be me. What makes you think there's anyone down here? Probably zombies. Actually, yeah, if it's zombies, then I won't get shot. <laughs> Mayor's out of Vermont. All the renovations money's being diverted into her pet project. That ridiculous treasures thing. Just today, they ripped out my storage room and started laying in marble floors. What she's gonna keep in there, gold bars? Swear this mess gets worse by the day. They keep badgering me to help with the project, but I don't want none of it. It's hard enough just to keep the place running as it is. First cold day of fall and the heat and system completely shorts out. Got plenty of complaints, but at least the temps weren't too bad. Give it another month or two and they'll wish they'd spent some of that money on maintenance. Some pre-war corruption, all right. Last week it was Protectrons. Today they had me set up some highfalutin laser security system. Things touchy as hell. Damn near shot me. I don't get it. They're taking over half the basement with this foolhardy thing, and they still think they can't be bothered to shore up the ceiling or fix the damn plumbing. All that won't matter much if the whole building collapses on top of it. I can't believe the city council's going along with it. Janner's starting to lose his mind, which is fair enough, because the people that he's reporting to are stupid. Treasures had all three visitors today. Surprised there weren't that many. F figured the security screens would keep them all away. Mayor tried to put a good face on it for the council, but the city's wasted so much money on this boondoggle, I'd be amazed if we don't impeach the lot of them. For now, I'll just try to keep the pipes patched up and the tourists out of my office. <laughs> they dumped their entire city budget into the treasures, and we're gonna pill for them ourselves. I'm willing to bet that the treasures probably is just like a slideshow about how great Jamaica Plains was. Oh, the real treasure was inside us all along. Yeah, I'm betting there's not actually a treasure down here. That's a lot of lasers. Welcome to the treasures of Jamaica Plain. The security system is active. Please present <laughs> your identification. Looks like we're on the right way. Maybe this treasure actually exists. Maybe so. But how do we get past the lasers? Well, if we have an identification badge... You have an ID reader. Oh, the janitor's ID! 
Is that gonna work? Convenient. Identification rejected. You do not have sufficient security clearance to access this area. Why wouldn't the janitor be allowed to access it? He's the janitor! Uh, um, uh, mm, mm, <clears throat> it's just me, the janitor's supervisor. Mr. Janitor. Don't mind me, just gonna walk on in here and clean up this place. Oh shit, it didn't work! It didn't work! Ah! Oh god, oh god! <laughs> I bet you can bypass all those lasers if you just can unlock that. Yep, yeah, yeah, I kinda figured. Yeah, but you didn't have a lockpicking skill. Yeah, <laughs> you have the locksmith one. You've been sitting at that level up for so long. What a. What a. Yeah! Woo, that's gonna blow up! This place reminds me of vomit. What? What? Cause it's gonna blow chunks, maybe? Why didn't it explode? All right, fine. That works. Are we ready to see the Jamaica pup? Darlene, stop that! You don't know what that will do. Are we ready to see the Jamaica planes? I uh, show me the treasure. Show us the treasure. Let's go. What the f- The Liberator? Ho oh, ho, nice pattern on that thing! Previously belonged to an unnamed patriot. It was deactivated and left to Jamaica Plains for future generations. Additional chance to cripple legs! Uh, well no, it's no additional chance to do anything because it's been deactivated. Didn't you see what it just said? Oh, my mistake. Welcome to the treasures of Jamaica Plain. Okay. Within the walls of this time capsule, you, our descendants, will find the items and mementos we treasured in the year 2077. To you, 200 years in the future, these relics may seem quaint. I treasured my skeleton. But we hope that remind you of our place in history and your own. As we laid the foundation for the world in which you live, so you too will lay a foundation for future generations. May that future be bright. On behalf of all of us in 2077, we wish you well. This is Mayor Alyssa Park speaking for the town of Jamaica Plain. I love my child, which is why I buried them down here. Uh, okay, a bowling ball, a bowling pin, a derby winning toy car, a youth league glove. Okay, we've got some really crappy treasures here, all right. Sweater vest, a green dress, a silver hairbrush, a pocket watch. Uh, some primitive stim stims. pack, a doctor's bag, prototype biometric scanner, a bone cutter, and a microscope. That's it. Good I job. almost died for this. Yep, that was definitely w worth it. I don't know if we should even bother seeming this Rex guy. WRVR is awful. I wanted to hear his opinion on the radio station. I'm gonna fast travel back to the house. Oh wait, no, we need to go to back to Somerville Palace and tell them we've succeeded. Yes. Just quit my last job. Looking for another. Oh, oh, you want a job? Okay, yeah, come work for us. Well, ain't that just a bit of luck. Where you need me? How many people are we gonna recruit today? Uh, all of them. Hey. You're back. Any luck clearing out that trouble spot? Yes, we cleared it out. Oh, it's nice to have some good news around here for a change. By the way, we've decided to support the Minutemen. Cool, I don't care what you do. We've gotta help each other if we want things to get better. Oh, what the f- what, what am I even doing with my life? Let's go home. Hey. You made it! Hello, Annie! Fresh flowers would brighten this place up. They would brighten this place up, you're right! Psst. You are carrying too much junk. Oh, was that you, was that you, Valkyrie? I'm sorry, I'm gonna get rid of it. Just give me a second. <laughs> Where the hell did this thing come from? I don't know, it's always been here, though. Can I- Oh, it's too heavy to carry, but I can kick it <laughs> like it's made out of tin foil. Yeah. Look at this! <laughs> too heavy, though. But that's too heavy for me to pick up! Yep. <laughs> yes, sir! Remains of a car or something. <laughs> there we go. Now it's someone else's problem. Look at me, I'm a pre-war corporation! <laughs> it's so heavy, it's floating! <laughs> this is gonna sound really dumb, but is it true you can fly? No, no, stupid question. Of course you can. Nope, I, I can't. <laughs> I'm always game for hunting down some bounties. Help me out and we'll split the caps. Bounties? Is it bounty time? I think it might be bounty time. <laughs> what was with that laugh? 
Back inside. What's up? No. Get out of my conga line. That's it. Thanks, Pop School. <laughs> Goodness. No respect. 